the money. If they behave, you're going to give them the money. Why don't we subtract the $80 billion from the $10 billion you're going to give them? Then they're minus 70 still. I mean, really, the fact that you're entertaining good behavior, that they'll get more money, I think is a big mistake and a naive notion that we're going to somehow change this Stone Age philosophy by giving them more of our money. We've sunk trillions of dollars over this. This is our chance to have a peace dividend. Let's quit sending good money after bad. The guy the Biden administration droned, was he an aid worker or an ISIS-K operative? Uh, the administration is, of course, reviewing that, uh, that strike, uh, and I'm sure that a you know, full assessment will be, will be forthcoming. So you don't know if it was an aid worker or an ISIS-K operative? Uh, I can't speak to that, and I can't speak to that in this setting in any event. So you don't know or won't tell us? Uh, I, don't, I don't know because we're, we're reviewing it. Well, see, you'd think you'd kind of know before you off somebody with a predator drone, whether he's an aid worker or he's an ISIS K. See, the thing is, is this isn't just you. It's been going on for administration after administration. The Obama administration droned hundreds and hundreds of people. And the thing is, is there is blowback to that. I mean, I don't know if it's true, but I see these pictures of these beautiful children that were killed in the attack. If that's true and not propaganda, if that's true, guess what? Maybe you created hundreds or thousands of new potential terrorists from bombing the wrong people. So you've got to know who you... We can't sort of have an investigation after we kill people. We have an investigation before we kill people.